Hi, I'm Charlie from uh, Advanced Technique Super Finishing. Uh, I want to go through another procedure of doing isotropic finishing that we use here at Advanced Techniques. I have a vintage Honda C CR250 transmission that is we have a lot of issues with and we, as you know, you can't buy parts for these and so we came up with a solution of polishing these parts. I wanted to show you the before and afters of what we're doing here. The other thing I wanted to show you is the camshaft and how we can refinish a camshaft, valve springs, rock arms. It's kind of a before finish, you know, how things look before we start and then after we go through the stages of the isotropic fi finishing, uh, we'll move forward. Uh, what I'd like to do next is show you what we use. There's a couple ways of doing uh, isotropic finishing. We can use it. We're using a paste now. There's two stages on the paste. This is kind of like a fine uh, toothpaste that we're using. So what we'll do now is we'll set up the machine here. We'll turn it on. And we'll just start putting the parts in. We ran the parts for six hours. As you can see, they came out. They're pretty much already done. That's the camshaft, and this is one of the gears that we are, are polishing. And what we do next is we have this paste. It's another paste from Rossler that we use. I use both the REM procedure on clean, doing parts on isotropic finishing and this and that, but I'll tell you that this, this new process of using this paste is a lot environmentally safer in that stuff. So basically what we do is we just come over here, turn the machine on. doing this for another six hours process. And, uh, anyway, I just wanted to show you what we do here. Okay, that's it. Okay, now we uh, had the parts all polished up the isotropic finishing. I just wanted to show you the finish. As you can see, the ring gear, how well it looks. Look at the valves, how they come out, the nice finish that they have. The rocker arms, all the rocker arm pads are looking good. Uh, the camshaft, you see how it looks here. Uh, we got to go through and uh, do some uh, taking the media out. This is a Honda CR250 Elsinore transmission. I just want to show you how the gears come out. Uh, this is the way to go on a vintage motorcycle for shifting or if you're racing, you can run a lot lighter oil in your. Uh, rear ends. Uh, this is a clutch hub off a 750 Honda. Uh, when we build engines here at Short Block Harley's, we uh, we we always isotropic all of the engine parts to give the customer the best satisfaction that he can have with our engine builds that we do. Um, I, we use Rossler for the product. Uh, it's uh, if you needed help or want to learn about isotropic finishing, uh, give me a call and I'll tell you how, the, how this operates. I want to thank you for watching and uh, uh, have a great day.